they are not going to allow aboboya, in other words, tricycles that carry uh, especially uh, refuse from households and other things and attempt to take them to Tema where the uh, re uh, recycling plant is. My brothers and sisters, you are aware the reason that Boboya are doing that is because that is where the treatment plant is. We don't have enough treatment plants within Accra itself. So for, for, if you see them on the highway going to Tema, it's simply because there's no other way they can dump it. So if the minister says somewhere next year they are going to stop them, let him be aware he's overstepping the authority under his watch. There's no law in this country that gives power to a regional minister to determine which vehicles drive on which roads. That is within the purview of the National Road Safety Authority and the Ministry of Road and Transport. The only way you should believe what the regional minister is saying is if he can quote a law that backs it. District assemblies and regional coordinating councils can't make a law and say vehicles cannot drive on a particular road. Indeed, I would have expected that we could even have a cycle lane along the motorway. So somebody who lives in Tema, who likes biking, can ride motorbike or bicycle from Tema to Accra. We don't have that one now. That is what we need to be looking at at, at the moment. So for the regional minister to say that they are going to ban the use of tricycles, I tell him, whilst you have a reason, you are just like treating malaria with paracetamol. The real cause is that the person has got malaria in his body and painkillers don't cure, uh, 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 how do you call it, uh, uh, malaria. You need to treat malaria itself, then the pain will go. There's no law in this country that gives the regional minister that right to say that they are going to ban Abu Boya on using the, the, the motorways. There's no law in this country. The only reason you can stop any road user, including pedestrians, cyclists, and, road, uh, and drivers, uh, when they fail to show that their vehicles are registered or they have the proper roadworthiness uh, certificate or they are driving unsafely on the road. Beyond that, there's no law in this country that stops any, anybody from using the road. So is a road, is a regional minister trying to suggest that he is taking the job of the, 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 uh, the MTTD and others? No. We all want to help him do his job. But it appears he's taking on responsibilities which he cannot back with any law in this country. And we are cautioning him. If they want to make changes to this, they should liaise with the, uh, the Minister of Road and, and Transport through the appropriate agencies for them to bring the appropriate laws to this house to be passed.